Hey everyone, it's sggcoop.com and we are back working on our Magic Kingdom book. And we're going to be doing the inside cover, which is the Astro Orbiter page. So initially when we did the book, um, I put this black paper down thinking that I was going to just use that as background. But because my pink is over it, it doesn't really look space enough. So what I did was I cut a piece of pattern paper that is 11 by 11 and I just trimmed a 12 by 12 piece. Um, I didn't give you a file for this because it's super easy just to cut one inch off of two sides of your paper. So I'm just going to glue this down as my base here. And you don't have to use an extra thing. Actually there is a file in the, um, there is a, a piece in the file that would cut this for you. I didn't, um, I didn't use it, but you you could actually. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna get this laid down right about like that. Okay, so we're you'll when you look at the file, you'll be able to see how the layout goes. But um, I made all of my pieces, and I used vinyl because you can see some of these pieces are super small and uh, using a nice vinyl will make it so that it's a lot easier to cut this and that you can see it better. Um, I probably would have chosen to use a little bit lighter gray uh, to make this stand out a little bit more if I was going to do this again. Um, but I just want to show you like some of the pieces here are very very small. So you just want to, uh, if you do paper, this might be a little bit tough, but vinyl works excellent. You could also make the pieces a little bigger if you wanted to. I did use paper for my planet and for my moon base. So first thing I'm going to do is glue down my moon base. I'm just going to use regular glue for that. Gonna get that glued right along the bottom there. Move this up so you can see. I'm just gonna glue that right there on the bottom. Okay. Then what I want to do is I'm just gonna sort of lay this out the way I intended it. And I put um, foam on the backs of all of my characters because I wanted them to pop up a little bit. So I'm gonna put Donald about there. Pluto is going to be right about there. Now, I also have um, the Astro Orbiter title, which I cut out of vinyl. Oops, and I missed a little piece here, so let me just grab that and get that out of there. And I was waiting. Um, okay, so what I want is for, I'm just going to trim this out actually. And I did cut all of this page together, so I cut you know, all of the whites together, all of the different colors out of vinyl. And it went together pretty quickly. Um, okay, so that's going to go about there. So I want Minnie to be able to not cover the R for Orbiter. So I'm just going to sort of lay this out where I want it. And then I'm also doing two photo mats. And actually, let me just grab a marker. Okay, and I'm just going to measure this really quick. Yeah, so this mat is going to hold a 4x6, so I'm just going to put 4x6 photo. And then this one, the other one, is going to be a 3x3. Three three. Okay, so these are going to go under here like this. And this one's going to go like that. Okay, so pretty much that's what our layout's going to look like. Let me just move this up a little so you can see the whole thing. And I also have a little gray piece to go underneath Mickey's feet that I actually ended up cutting out of vinyl. It would have been fine to cut out of paper, but I ended up cutting it out of vinyl. So now if I can figure out where I put it, I can get that laid down also. Let's see.
Okay, so I found my little piece, and actually, I'm not going to use transfer tape. I'm just going to peel this off because it's a pretty basic piece. So it kind of just works like a sticker. So I'm just going to kind of figure where I want Mickey, and this is just going to go underneath just to ground him a little bit. Like that. Okay. So, and what I'm going to do is, although I have foam underneath, I'm just going to trim this a little, underneath um, the rocket, I don't want to glue that down until I get my photo in here. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to glue down my photo mat. So I'm just going to get some glue. I'm just going to go along the edges here. There. Give that a good rub. Okay. And I'm going to glue down my planet next. Glue that in the top corner. Okay. And then I'm going to use my transfer tape. And I'm just going to grab my title and let's see if I can find my little scraper here for a second. There it is. When you're doing these um, pieces, by the way, if you're using vinyl and you're using transfer tape, make sure you scrape it very well on the paper, background paper, because the pieces are so small you don't want to miss any of them. So, alright, I'm going to put this Kind of like there. And you might have to give it a little rub to get it to stick. Okay. So now I can put some glue on Pluto. This is a very inexpensive way to make your own uh, foam dots or whatever you want to call them. Um, the other day when we were working on the cover, I used the score tape, which also works great. But since I'm going to let this sit a little bit, the glue is fine. Okay, so I'm going to glue mini. If you're not sure how to use vinyl and layer it on paper like this, I do have training videos on how to do that. It's much easier than you might think it is. And it's so much fun because all the pieces just line right up and you can just lay them down um, all at once. So like I did all of the white at once and I started with the white background with all of these. Um, except for Donald, I put the blue down first because it was the closest to a border that I could get and it worked out. Um, okay, so for this one, I'm just going to glue the bottom half because I need to be able to fit a picture behind it. So I'm just going to put some glue on the bottom half of that photo. Get Mickey glued down. Okay, so I'll get him no. right there. And then we just have to glue down Donald and then we're done. So now Donald, I'm not going to put the glue on the back of his rocket until uh, I get a photo in there. Once I do, then I'll glue it down. Okay. And get Donald right about there. Okay. 
Okay, and there we go. That's going to be our inside cover to our book. All right, thanks for watching. We'll be back with starting some pages. Thanks for watching.